Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. I'm gonna pull some energy, how you're coming into the reading and how your person is coming into the reading. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Taurus with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see. Um, how is Taurus coming into the reading? How is Taurus feeling? How is Taurus? Where's Taurus energy? Let's see, okay. Um, so it could be, I dumped you now. I want you back. Please forgive me. All right. So maybe you didn't put a lot of energy, effort, time into a love relationship and now you want someone back. Okay. Um, bored. It was in the reverse. It was like, maybe you want to come out of boredom or maybe you're bored or you were bored with, um, some other option or maybe, um, someone was boring you. Let's see. Um, you have not healed. You need to heal. All right. So I don't know if you just like you're pursuing this because you are bored. You want to come out of boredom, but you really haven't healed yet. Maybe you were playing with somebody's emotions because this is your energy. And now you want to kind of, yeah, maybe seduce them. Yeah. To come back, um, to come back and play, you know, but the cards are saying maybe you haven't healed yet. Yeah, it's like you want to reconcile with this person. Um, but it might be. Maybe you want to come out of this erratic and irrational type of energy. You just don't know how. Maybe this is all you do know. You know how to seduce, you know, get the person back. But at the, at the same time, the cards are saying that you need to go through a healing process. Um, Maybe you're looking at somebody, you're differently not looking at them as a boring option anymore. You're trying to make a rational decision. Also, you're trying to, you know, move, make a residential, residential move. It's like maybe you're trying to get more serious, more committed to yourself and to others. Yeah, you're trying to maybe fulfill promises. It's like you want to retire one way that you've been for a very long time. Yeah, you could even be trying to be better, you know, have better growth in relationships, maybe even in your body, also working on yourself. You come to some understanding that maybe um, you didn't take relationships serious. People didn't take you serious um, or vice versa. Or it was mutual. Um, but now you want you um, are growing. You want growth. OK, let's see how the person that you're coming to the reading for how they feel how does the person that Taurus is coming to the reading for how do they feel so they are sexting you <laughs> they feel like your body is perfect so they could be in a real physical place with you in a very physical yeah they they like you so it's real it's still kind of early or it's still kind of new or it's still in that awkward place of I don't know where this is going so let's keep it real surface level real physical real like we used to, but it's like maybe you're coming to a place where you want something long term. Um, it could be that maybe trust has been broken. Let's see. How does this person feel? How does this person feel? Maybe when they were trying to grow something with you, you, you didn't want it. They feel like they are miserable in their relationship if they have one or in their home. They could be drinking a lot. They get drunk and they think about you and then maybe they sext you. This is a real smart person, real fast talker, fast thinker. They know what to say. Maybe they dominate the conversation. Okay. They feel like you're very feminine and warm. They could still, they feel like you have a hard exterior though. It's like maybe at one time they did want to do something serious with you, surprise you with a new life, new home, new car, new baby, just a big surprise. And maybe at one time they were plain old addicted, but maybe you put others before the relationship. Uh, they felt like they were too good for you. Okay. And now they're holding back their emotions, oh, definitely holding back their emotions because they feel like it's valuable and they're separating emotions and sex and all of this stuff. So maybe they put you into a category or a box right now. What is the advice for Taurus? And this also could be vice versa. Um, what is the advice for Taurus? What is the advice 
for Taurus. Um, so yeah, get more information. I think you need to have a conversation with this person, be clear on where you stand in their life and what they want from you and what you want from them. Uh, understand that if there is rejection here, if somebody's not open to what you want, there's something better. Um, if you have a yes or no, and yes or no question, the answer is yes. Okay. It just might not be the right time as the cards say that you, you haven't healed yet. Um, something about you is not open, you know, you don't have a overflow of something to give. Yeah, that's what I have for you. If it resonates, go over to the website, book your reading there, ask a question or two by texting your question to the number below. You'll find all of that in, in the description box below. Catch me live tonight, Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.